and welcome back to the breakdown. Today I'm going to be teaching you how to install the Enigmatic 2 mod pack in Minecraft. This is a pretty cool mod pack with over 800 quests as well as 250 different mods. I mean, there's biomes of plenty, Tinker's Construct, Mechanism, Chisel, Pam Sarver's Craft, Immersive Engineering, Thermal Expansion, so many more over 250 mods in this mod pack. And it even has a expert version of the mod pack if you're looking for a really really good challenge so basically this is an in-depth guide on how to get enigmatic 2 and enigmatic 2 expert because it's the same process it's just uh which one you want to play when you're all said and done first thing we do have a message from our sponsor which is apex minecraft hosting if you want a server running the enigmatic 2 mod pack guess what apex minecraft hosting is going to be the server host for you they have one click installation of over 50 mod packs it is absolutely incredible you can check out apex the first link down below the breakdown of xyz slash apex we actually love apex so much that we host our own server on them play.breakdowncraft.com so if you're looking for an incredible 24-hour dnos break to minecraft server for you and your friends running enigmatic 2 or any other mod pack or vanilla minecraft that you want check out apex minecraft hosting again these the first link down below the breakdown.xyz slash apex nevertheless once you're here once you're ready to get rocking and rolling you actually need to go to the second link down below and it will take you here because you need the twitch app to be able to run the enigmatic 2 mod pack that's because twitch is a minecraft mod pack launcher so once you're here you want to click on the download for windows button because we're on windows and this is just a desktop app here so go ahead and click download for windows and it will download in the bottom left now if we minimize our browser i have enigmatic open in the background and close out of that but nevertheless we have the twitch setup here so let's go ahead and double click on the twitch setup and it will automatically open up like any other program you then want to click install and it will go through install things do some stuff and for me the twitch app will open because i've already got twitch installed however if you don't have the twitch app installed you may have to double click on this it's created a shortcut in your desktop just double click on that then you'll have to log into the twitch app so if i log out here you'll land on a log Login screen like this where you do want to log in so let me go ahead and log in real quick there we go now we're logged into the main menu here that well we were just on now once we're here we want to click on the mods tab up here in the menu bar of the twitch app and it will take us over to here now minecraft probably won't be lit up for you it'll probably be blurred out like any of these just find it in this list and when you click on it you will have a purple install button in the bottom center of the screen here it'll look like this scan now button but it'll be purple and in the center of the screen and say install click on that and then once you do that you'll land on a page like this and as you can see no profiles installed that means you don't have any mod packs installed but no worries go ahead and click browse mod packs and then search for the enigmatic mod pack and here it is we have enigmatic 2 expert and enigmatic 2 you also have the skyblock variant there if you want to play that however we're just going to install both of these now basically to install them it's the same process if you want to play expert click on install if you want to play enigmatic 2 just normal click on install we're going to do the normal one just click on install there and it will go ahead and download you can install both of these at the same time if you want i'm just not going to because i mean this just doubles the time that this video runs if I install both of these mod packs. So I'm gonna go ahead and let it download the 200 plus mods here. And once it's done, I will meet you uh, to get the mod pack up and running. There we go, it is now done installing. You know that because the, uh, well, bar of loading things up and downloading mods and all that stuff is done. And you have a purple play button here. Now normally when you click on mods, you'll land on the My Mod Packs tab, which also has its own purple play button. So wherever you're at, just go ahead and click on that purple play button on Ignig Mag 2. Now it's gonna take a while to open up. It's gonna open up the Minecraft launch for the first time. and most likely you'll actually need to log in to the minecraft launcher you'll be on this screen and you're going to use the same information that you would normally use to log into the default minecraft launcher because guess what this is the default minecraft launcher that's one of the benefits of all these mod packs switching to twitch instead of like their own independent launchers it's because you can actually use the default minecraft launcher so i'm going to go ahead and log in real quick to the minecraft launcher and i will see you once i've done that there we go we have logged in now when you're here you should be able to click the little green arrow next to the play button here and you should have enigmatic 2 if that's the case go ahead and click on it but don't click play immediately what you want to do is click on launch options up here and if you don't have that click the three lines up in the top right and then click on launch options and then find the enigmatic 2 mod pack and then we're going to add more ram to it so as you can see by default here this is using 3.2 gigabytes of ram this mod pack is pretty extensive it's got over 200 mods in it so you're going to need more ram than that i wouldn't recommend going over probably eight gigabytes for this mod pack but if you need more information about how much ram is the maximum you can give to minecraft and all that stuff check out the eye at the top of your screen for my complete guide on adding ram to minecraft for this i'm just going to go ahead and throw eight gigabytes at it that's probably a bit of overkill but it is what it is for right now and yeah that's just 
going to work for this quick tutorial. So we can go ahead and click save on that, come back over to the news tab, again confirm that it says Enigmatic 2 down here at the bottom. And by the way, if you open it up and it doesn't have that, you don't have the profile and you're freaking out, no worries. Close out of the Minecraft launcher, come back to the Twitch app, hit play again, and it'll magically appear. Nevertheless, we can go ahead and click play in the Minecraft launcher and it will open up the Enigmatic 2 mod pack. Now, just like with anything in mod packs, it's going to take a while. It's going to take a long while actually to open up for the first time. So I'm just going to sit here and uh, do a jump cut because I don't think you want to listen to me talk for 20 minutes. You might want to though. I don't know. Anyway, I'm just going to do a jump cut. And here we are in the Enigmatica 2 mod pack. So as we can see, 270 mods loaded. I'm just going to go ahead and create a quick and easy single player world for you to, um, you know, just see that this is up and running and we're good to go. So I'm going to let this load up yet another jump cut and then we'll be, uh, we'll be done with the video. And here we are in Enigmatica 2. So, um, this is actually a really cool mod pack and everything is here. This is the, this is the quest book. You just left click with it and it kind of walks you through everything. I mean, it's, it's all here. Walks you through all sorts of these different mods and mod packs and or everything. It's just absolutely incredible. If you want to learn about like all of these different mods, like what does Thumbcraft do? Here you go. This walks you through it. Tinker's Construct. This walks you through it. Beating Starvation. How to make some different kinds of food. There you go. I mean, it is all here. Ender IO, Forest Street. It is just, it's absolutely incredible. So this is the best mod pack for learning mods that I've seen in a long time. So, um, yeah, if you're wanting to get into mod in Minecraft and kind of get walked through it, here you go. But nevertheless, if you did enjoy this video and you now have Enigmatica 2, please give the video a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel for more awesome content. And if you have any questions about this mod pack or any other, let me know in the comment section down below. I'll be more than happy to help you out. My name is Nick. Come play with us at the best Minecraft server in the multiverse, play.breakdowncraft.com. We've got custom skyblock. We've got 1.13.2, soon to be 1.14, grief protected survival. So again, come play with us, play.com breakdowncraft.com is the IP. Anyway, my name is Nick. Thank you so, so much for watching, and I am out. Peace.